What are those, Gray? Drums. Drums, play me a song. Porter's over here playing music. We're at the park with my mom's group. They were giving out free popsicles. It's actually a beautiful day for the park. It's like super windy, so it feels nice. Just playing at the park. We don't usually go to this one because it's a little further out. But it's nice because it has like this huge tent to keep it shaded on really hot days. I guess a lot of kids play like soccer out there. Like these are like known for soccer fields and then it just has a really nice playground. This is super fun. Of course, all the kids are over there playing with each other. And then my kids are off by themselves doing their own thing. Porter keeps running up to every boy and saying that they're gray gray. He keeps saying gray gray, gray gray. Gray just runs off and does his own thing. It's very hard keeping tabs on two kids. Let me tell ya. No. everyone so as you saw in the previous clip we started our day out with going to the park i'm part of a mom's group i've talked about it on the vlog before but i'm part of a mom's group it's just a bunch of moms around this area and we get together and do different meetups and events and different things like that and this event was a kickoff to summer so a ton of moms got together at this local park they, there's like a board of people that like kind of plan all the play dates and stuff and they have brought bubbles and popsicles to have for all the kids to have so it was really nice and it was beautiful weather it was like 70s but it was super windy it felt so good so that was really fun. We saw some moms. We I used to go to events all the time, but now that I have two kids, it's just a lot harder to get out to events. I find that a lot of the events are during nap time or sometimes the kids are sick or I just am worried about going to a certain place with two kids and only one of me. So we don't go to as many events as I used to, but this one I thought would be a good one to go to, so we did. And we've been to that park before, so I was familiar with it. It was a little difficult like keeping my eyes on both because now that Porter's mobile they're both going in like the total opposite directions and so it's very hard to keep my eye on who's going where. Do you want more? Look. Here you go. You want yogurt? No. Oh, Porter's been eating some yogurt but then he just stopped. You want milk? Yeah. Okay. okay. Um, Porter wants some milk. He's been really attached to milk lately, and I remember Grayson going through this phase. I don't. I thought he was older than Porter, but Porter is just very into milk right now, and he drinks a lot of it. Um, so I try to get him on different things. I was. He was just eating yogurt, um, but it stopped. So kind of hard to get him to want to eat other things other than milk. So anyway, back to the park date. It was fun. Um, we saw some moms and some friends. Like I said, they had um, free pop schools for the kids and they were like the Otter Pop stuff. It's just like colored, flavored ice in a tube and you like cut it off and you, you know, you know what I'm talking about. That was the first time I believe that the boys have ever had those and they both like had no idea how to eat it porter ended up like spilling it all down his shirt and down my leg and grayson like took one bite of it and decided he didn't like it he didn't like how it was cold it's a popsicle so those are kind of a fail but they loved the park they had so much fun so i got that clip earlier of them doing that and now we're just kind of hanging out at home it was raining so the boys are watching a show but it, now it's sunny outside, so we might eat dinner and then maybe we can go outside for a little bit. 
It was supposed to thunderstorm all afternoon, but now it's sunny, so I'm not exactly sure what's going on with the weather. But yeah, they're both over here um, watching a show. I'll show you. Grace, say hi. Hey. Hi, Porter. I found a diamond. Oh, a diamond. They're watching some super simple songs on YouTube, so. Only for a little bit longer, and then we're gonna have dinner, and then I guess we're gonna go outside, so. Anthony is actually at the office today, so it feels very quiet and lonely here at the house. My brother came and picked up Berkeley, so we're not dog sitting anymore, and we're just kind of hanging out and chilling. I don't know much of what else we're going to do today. I find that, you know, you think in the summer, like, there would be so much for me to film because there's no, like, less commitment, some more, like, things we can go do. But I find it's the opposite. Like, I find myself just doing the same thing over and over again in the summer. Like, we go outside, we play in the backyard, we go to the neighborhood park, or we go to a park around town. And that's kind of it. So at least we have this vacation coming up, and that'll kind of break it up. But I just don't have that much to, like, show you guys or tell you guys. Um... We might go see a couple houses this week. Um, every day more houses come on the market, so we might go see a few. None of them are really like jumping out to me at the moment, but there's still time for more houses to come on the market, so we will see. Not sure I really wanna like win a house and then go on vacation right after it, so not sure how that would go, but um, we'll see. I mean, if the right house comes along, then maybe we will, but. Yeah, I guess not much else to talk to you guys about. Um, we'll go outside after dinner and I'll try to remember to vlog. I don't really know what we're going to do because it's not like we can go to the park because it'll be all wet. So we're just going to like stay around here. Gray does love riding his bike and then I'll push Porter in the stroller after him. So maybe we'll do that. But I've been really struggling trying to figure out what to make for dinner for the kids. Um, I don't know why I've just been struggling with it. I think it's because like I'm trying not to get too much food because we're going on vacation And so like it's just limiting my dinner options and also I just feel like I make the same dinner Like every few days and I need to like switch it up. So if you guys have any like kid approved <laughs> Dinner recipes that I can make for the kids put them down in the comments below my kids are pretty picky Porter not so much but gray is pretty picky so if you have any easy, quick recipes for kids, let me know. Um, I should really start like researching and Googling and stuff, but I forget every time to do it. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna try to look around and see what I should make the kids for dinner. Now it's time to clean up and put a clean away. Yeah, clean up, clean up. We all have on today. But now it's time to clean up and put all the food away. Dog, clean up, clean up. We have fun today. Now it's time to clean up and put everything away. What do you got, Porter? Bee-bee. Look, Mom, Bee -bee. I'm cleaning up my yeah. mosaic time. Good job, Gray. We've been working with Grayson about cleaning up after he makes messes before we move on to the next activity. And it's kind of hard to learn, but we're doing it, huh? And Porter over here is obsessed with my oven mitts. He has a hard time putting both on at the same time. Oh, there he goes. Go, go. You got, you got the oven mitts? He loves putting them on. Gray does it too, but this is pretty fun, says Porter. Hope. 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 Yeah. Let me put it on for you. Yeah. You got it. There you go. Okay. No, no. No, no. Oh, whoa. Porter is so cute. He keeps walking in the, around the house saying, Berkey, Berkey. Where's Berkey? They keep saying, Where is Berkey? She went back to her house. I know, he keeps saying, Berkey, she's not here anymore, Berkey. huh? I know. Berkey. Berkey. Yep, clean up and then we're going to go outside. Yeah. Well, it was looking sunny and now it's looking cloudy again. So are we going to get rained on? Yeah. Oh, I see some blue sky. I think we'll be okay, but probably won't last very long. So the boys are cleaning up and then we're going to go outside. 
I ended up making um, cheesesteak stuffed peppers. I've made it once before and I think it was good. It's been a while. So Anthony's on his way home from work. And so I'm gonna have dinner ready for him, which is nice. Um, the boys were cheering me on as I was making the dinner. But it had um, the meat in this recipe is shaved steak, which is unique because I don't really use that a lot. But it was really easy to cook because it's steak, but it's just shaved really thinly. And so it browns really fast. So we'll see. Um, how we like it. I guess we've had it before, but I really don't remember if it was good or not. So hopefully it's good. Um, I always try to have some sort of meal ready for Anthony when he comes home after a long day of work. Although I tend to do uh, a recipe every other day and then on the off days we'll just do like leftovers or fend for yourself or we usually will get like a frozen pizza and have that. I did it. Did you finish? Yeah. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. But Porter's making a mess. Porter, Grayson just cleaned that up. Oh man. Did mommy clean it up? Yeah, you don't have to clean up this time because Porter made the mess. Do you want to go outside or no? Okay, then let's get your shoes and socks on. Also, I think my boys, oh sorry, I think my boys got peanut butter all over the couch. So I need to get a spray and spray it down. We desperately need a new couch. Look at that couch. It's so clean. I don't think it's clean. It's just Are you being crazy? Porter's got the zoomies. Light yeah, lights Look, on. I've got the zoomies oh, too. Yo, you do? Okay, run, run, run. Woo. Oh boy. I don't, how do you guys have all this energy? Oh, oh, yay! Good catch, Porter. Uh oh, Gray, say sorry, Porter. Come give him a hug. Come give him a hug. Oh, and give him a kiss. Okay, that's better. The light is on. Yeah, you turned extra lights on, huh? Light. Light. We have Felix here. Say hi, Felix. Hi, Beef. Hi, Beef. Porter now calls Felix Feet. Because I think it sounds close to Fief, which is a nickname we have for him, and so he goes around saying feet, feet, and it's hilarious. <laughs> feet. Oh, be nice to Felix. Be nice. We're working on being gentle. He says Look at this energy that I'm dealing with right now. What am I supposed to do with this? Ha <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>